Okay. Uh, hi guys, welcome to our pre-match uh, press conference ahead of uh, tomorrow's game against uh, Hyderabad FC. Uh, today's press conference will be addressed by first by our striker Bartok Beche, followed by our head coach uh, Sergio Libera. Uh, the rules same as always. Please put in your name in the chat box if you have a question for either. I'm going to hand over the stage to Bart. Okay, hey guys, uh, if you have a question for Bart, please put in your name in the chat box. Okay, Tarkesh from Khelna. Hi Bart, uh, I just wanted to ask, uh, how have the last two been? Last two games been for you? You didn't play as much at the start of the season, but come the two most important games, you scored in crucial goals in both of them. Do you think uh, you are well placed to start all the games ahead, going ahead of this? Yeah, good afternoon. I think uh, the last two games have been as important for us like every single game of the season. And uh, like you said, uh, even though I haven't started every game, I do prepare as if I want to start every game. And uh, the choice is up to the coach. But I think uh, the most important thing, like I've always said and emphasized on, is the fact that, uh, you know, uh, the team has to win. You know, the team's uh, goal outweighs any individual goal. So uh, our victory is going to come from the basis that the team is ahead of every one of us. So I am always ready. You know, I'm always available for the coach to make choices. And uh, he can count on me any day, any time. But the most important thing is for us to keep on winning games. Thanks, Tarkesh. Um, move on to the next one. Yash Pratap from Sports Kindle. Yash, please ask a question. Good afternoon, Bart. Yes, side. So my question for you is: You have proved your worth for every hero IFL club you have played in, you have played for. So how does it feel? Sorry, I didn't hear the last. His question is that you proved your worth for each club that you played. So how do you how do you feel about that? Uh, actually, um, good afternoon. Uh, actually, I'm I'm always excited. You know, for me, every time is like the start. You know, I. I've been I've been working really very hard. It's true that you only see, you know, what happens, you know, on game days. But uh, behind the scenes, there's a lot of work, and um, I'm excited. I always think I can improve, and I believe I can improve. And I can tell you, if anything, I'm happy to to be in this environment, you know, to be at Mumbai City because uh, uh, there's a lot of room, you know, for me to improve with uh, the coaches I have at hand, with the players with me. So uh, what I've done in the past uh, doesn't count so much for me. The, the thing that really motivates me is what I can do tomorrow. And, uh, and for that, I have to really work hard today to be able to improve tomorrow and make tomorrow even better than what has, what has been done in the past. So I think uh, that's always my challenge. And that's always my drive. And that's something that always pushes me to, to keep on working very hard. Thanks, Yash. Arsh. Thank you, Bart. Good, good luck for the season ahead. Thank you. Arsh. Good afternoon, Bart. Uh, one of the main reasons why you came to Mumbai was because you admired the style of play of Sergio Lovera. And after 10 games in this season, how has your experience been in this new system? Good afternoon. Uh, yeah, you're right. Uh, that's true. And uh, after 10 games, uh, it's been a great experience so far. Uh, but the fact is, we are not any different than other teams. We didn't have a lot of time, you know, to prepare during the preseason because of the conditions that we are all aware of. But uh, the short time we've had, I think we've really, really made a lot of uh, improvements, you know, a lot of progress in respect, you know, with regards to the way the coach wants to play, with his style of play. And also, not just the, the coach or his assistants, but we, the players, trying to adapt to each other. So it's, uh, it's been great. And the most inside, uh, exciting part for me is that there's still a lot, a lot of room for improvement. And we know we can improve. We are aware of that. We always talk about that. So it's been, it's been great so far. But uh, we hope to, to even make it better from now on to the end of the season. Thanks, Ash. Uh Guys, if there are any more questions uh, for Bart, please uh, take one final round. Just give it 10 seconds. Okay, thank you guys. Thank you, Bart. All right. Yeah. Good luck.
Hey guys, the same drill as always. Please put in your name in the chat box. Let's wait for the first one. I think uh, Marcus has raised his hand. Marcus has a question. Yeah, Coach, hi. Uh, many happy returns. We happy birthday to you. Thank you. Uh, Coach, uh, you know, uh, Mumbai City got uh, uh, 25 points out of a maximum of 30 in the first leg. Yeah. Do you believe Mumbai City can continue with a similar performance in the in the second leg? Or do you think this team still has to, I mean, still can get even better? Yeah? Uh, I am very happy uh, with the results so far. Uh, you know, it's very difficult to, to win uh, eight games uh, in the... Uh, 10 uh, first games, uh, 25 points. Uh, it's very difficult uh, to keep the, this, uh, this situation because it's not easy. But the most important thing for us is not put our focus you know, on, the, on the table, on the points, on, on the results. Uh, it's put our focus in trying to keep uh, our performance, in trying to continue improving, in, in, and we need to understand this situation is the past. Uh, we are... Uh, halfway and we need uh, to work a lot and uh, there are a lot of work to do uh, in the next uh, months. Thank you coach and all the best for the match tomorrow. Thank you so much. Thank you. We have uh, Srivatsan. Srivatsan has a question. Uh, good afternoon coach and advance happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you. It's tomorrow. Uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, Coach, uh, I do understand that uh, you don't talk about individual players, but if possible, uh, could you tell a few words about Vignesh, the young left back? You know, I don't like to speak about individual players, but uh, I want to add, uh, answer your question. I am very happy with Vignesh. I think uh, he's a very good player. Uh, he worked very hard to try to adapt quickly. In our style of play, in the in play in the first eleven, uh, when uh, we need. Uh, he played with uh, in the first eleven, and uh, I am very happy. He need to continue working in the same way. He need to improve uh, the same all, all the players, and uh, I am very happy so far with the performance of Pines when we need to use him. Thank you, coach, and all the very best for tomorrow's game. Thank you. We have uh, Yash from Sports Kingdom. Good afternoon, coach. Good afternoon. So. Uh, what's gonna be your approach towards the game uh, against Hyderabad? Uh, I think going, I am sure it's going to be a very difficult game. I think they are uh, playing in a similar style of play of uh, us. Uh, they are, they have a, a very good team with a very young players and very good Indian players, and also very experienced players, uh, foreign players. Uh, I think. It's uh, going to be a, a different game uh, we played uh, against uh, them uh, because uh, he, they recover a lot of players and uh, they have a full squad now uh, because they had uh, a lot of problems with injuries. Uh, but the most important thing for us is to be loyal in our style of play, to try to, to keep the possession of the ball, to have the ball because they are uh, a team comfortable with the ball and to win the possession of the ball, I think, is very important for tomorrow's game. Thank you, coach. Good luck for tomorrow's game. Thank you. Thanks. Uh, Harsh from IFTWC. Hi, Sergio. Uh, a lot of Indian players in this team didn't play under you before and uh, you didn't play in your style of play before and you had a short preseason as well. But even after that, the team is five points. Uh, the team is having a five-point lead at the top of the table. Can you tell us something about the Indian players adapting so quickly to your style of play? I am very happy and I am very proud of my Indian players. And uh, it's not easy to, as I told you before, uh, working in a short season, try to implement a new style of play uh, in a new club with uh, twenty-four new players and I think it's very important the level of Indian players if you want to achieve something important. And uh, the level of my Indian players is, is amazing. Uh, they are improving day by day. And uh, the, the most important thing is uh, their attitude is uh, want to learn uh, every day. And uh, I am very happy with the level of Indian players. And I think it's very important for us if we want to win uh, trophies, we need the, the, the level of Indian players is, uh, was, uh, will be very high. 
during all the session. Thank you, Sarkesh. Sarkesh from Kerala. Yeah, uh, hello coach. Uh, your former player Liston Colasso is doing very well with Hyderabad this season. He scored two goals in the previous match group. Do you think that he'll put a tough challenge in front of Mumbai City FC tomorrow in tomorrow's game? Uh, he is a very good player. He is an excellent person. Uh, was uh, amazing to work with him because uh, he's a very good player. And uh, but uh, tomorrow's game uh, is not possible to decide only uh, about one player, over player, or the player. Uh, we need a collective uh, job. Uh, we need to work uh, as a team uh, to try to to win the game. Uh, and uh, Hyderabad also. This one is a very good player. Uh, tomorrow, I don't know if it's possible to play in the first eleven. Uh, but uh, he is a, a very good player, but our focus is uh, to play against a very good team, not only a very good player. Thanks, Arkesh. Uh, Sandeep has raised his hand. Sandeep, ask a question. Hi, Coach. Uh, first of all, happy birthday. So uh, I just wanted to uh, check on the fact that we all know how important Jahu is to your style of play. And in the last game, which is probably the hardest game for you, uh, he was not there and the Indian boys stepped up in that place. So how happy are you with these options that uh, there are Indians who can step up to that role? Yeah, uh, obviously Jaco is a very important player for us and for the whole team. But uh, as I told you before, the most important thing is the collective work. And I am very happy with the performance of the, the team in the last game. Uh, it was a very difficult game against a very good team. And the performance the players uh, played uh, was, uh, was very very, very good. It was amazing. And it's an amazing problem, a big problem for me now to, to choose what uh, is the best uh, first 11 for the next game. Uh, this is an amazing problem uh, for me as a coach because when you have uh, options uh, to, to, to choose uh, the best players and you have a very good squad, uh, it's, a, it's a big problem, but uh, it's the, the problem every coach want, uh, want to have. Thanks, Sandeep. Um, Harsh, once again, I think Harsh has a follow-up question. Uh, coach, can you give us the team news before tomorrow's game? The team news. No, uh, I need to check after the... We have uh, the last training before the game, but everyone is fit now. Uh, guys, any more questions uh, for the head coach? We'll just give it 30 seconds. I don't think anyone's raised their hand either. Okay, great. Thank you, guys. Uh, thank you so much, coach. Thank you. Thanks, guys, uh, for being good as, as usual. Um, we'll see you ahead of our next game against East Bengal.